virtual reality, television, and the internet are the main areas in which we develop new technologies. The first such technology we would like to introduce you to is the virtual sphere. This is a device for full immersion into virtual reality. With its help, the user can physically walk through virtual space. This new quality will make the virtual sphere an essential and popular product. Its greatest distribution will be in the entertainment industry. Video game arcades, Disneyland's, fun fairs, clubs, and casinos. The player himself will become the hero and will chase monsters through mazes of popular computer games such as Doom, Quake, and Unreal. With the virtual sphere, it is possible to conduct a television show of a new kind. The script of a whole cycle of such a program has already been developed. The virtual sphere can be used for sports training and the proper pacing of health programs. It will become a simulator with completely new possibilities. By merely connecting several devices to a network, and loading a special training program. With the virtual sphere, it will be possible to improve cooperation among the members of anti-terrorist groups and to train the members of various departments of power structures. The virtual sphere advertising industry. One area to profit from this will be that of virtual tourism. The clients of tourist agencies will be able to make a fact-finding walk on a selected route. And finally, the virtual sphere is a perfect teaching tool. The lessons of history, geography, and many other subjects will be better understood and retained. The virtual sphere is a universal device which can be adapted to different applications by simply loading different programs. It is simple in operation and can be operated by one person. Our next development is the virtual suit. The virtual suit and its operating software, Motions Capture, is intended for the monitoring of the user's movements. Its simplicity of operation and low price guarantee a broad application to the following areas. Interactive teaching of sports and dance movements, creation of a library of movement, creation of animated films and computer animation, remote control by robots, virtual doubles, etc., through internet, and medical rehabilitation systems. What is being offered is a new virtual studio. Its novelty lies in the fact that the telehero wears a virtual helmet which enables him to interact with objects of virtual space, real-time mode. Using these features, possible to film a television show of a new type. The last development we would like to introduce is the Game Studio. The Game Studio has two virtues. First, it allows for real-time filming and showing of competitions and games. Second, it maximizes the spectator's sense of immersion in the world of games, providing him with much deeper emotion than provided by other filming methods. This technology will allow for the creation of a cycle of weekly telecasts in which the spectator will feel himself a participant of events in the studio. The spectator will be able to watch the live interaction of the show's participants with the characters of computer games. Moreover, it will be possible to create new learning and demonstration programs for mastering the new interface. 
This technology can also be used for conducting tests and competitions. We are a group of professionals. If you are confronted by a problem not having a traditional solution, that's for us. The non-standard approach, that's our style. Write us 